Today, guys, we're doing the most evil villain of the Lego Knights himself, Lord Vladek. So, um, yes, Lord Vladek. He was, or Valdek, am I saying that right? It's Vladek. I was right. <laughs> he is the eagle leader of the, uh, Lego Knights. Um, I did have the minifigure for him when I was littler, but I don't know where that went now. But today we have Vladek here. Now, I don't usually do Lego stuff, this is my first Lego review ever, so, this is going to be something new. Now, they produced these in, let's see, I don't know the exact date, 2004, wow. I got these when I first moved to that place I'm living in now, when I was very little, four to six, I think I was six or something, but. These dudes were heaven to me, and I still have them today. I have a complete set, so we probably will do a thing where I do one one day and then one another day. So today is Vladek, because he's probably my favorite one. Um, I do remember getting this one at the store. He was a very fun purchase. Anyway, so yeah, Lego Knights Vladek. He is very nice. He has all those nice plastic ratchy joints, so he can kind of go up. He can do a... Uh, Sidekick, he can do a rotate, he can bend his knee, it can go both ways, that looks a bit painful, but his foot's also articulated, so he does have some posability. Um, I guess we can go over his gimmicks, so just like all the Lego Knights, this, there's a little switch on the back right there, where uh, if you flicked it, his sword comes off. But, uh, yeah, but the gimmick was you could flick it and you could attack someone else. Um, his shield, his little animal thing is a scorpion, as you can see, red, black, he just was the e very evil dude. Um, he was the only bad guy ever released in the line, I don't think they ever made any other ones. On the back it only shows the five knights, they don't even show the king on the back. But as we can look at the back, so it shows the second gimmick, first gimmick, there's that. In the front, you just got a nice picture of Vladek there. Um, so yeah, he is a pretty articulated figure. These things are not bad at all. Gimmick-wise, you, you can, the other second gimmick is that he's got the face reveal. He doesn't look like a very happy person. I know if I was, if I ran into him in a dark alley, I wouldn't be very, feel very safe around him, but it's pretty neat. I don't think he shares a sword mold with anyone, but um, I think it's a different. He might share a mold with the uh, the green one. I forget his name. God. Oh, it's up there. Ragu. Razga. Whatever. It's the green dude. I think he ha they have the same sword, I'm pretty sure. And I think that's the only one that ever shares a sword. A bit disappointing, but what are you going to do? So that is Lodek, the evil. You can do a little dance. But, uh, yeah, that that's Vladek, the evil lord of evil from the Lego Knight set. So, thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this. These are just a fun little thing that I loved as a child and want to review today. So, there's Vladek, and I will see you guys in another review. Thank you for watching.